You'll find little welcome here, Jedi. For your own good, I recommend you speak to Administrator Adari, quickly finish your business in Kunda, and go. I will answer your questions. She was the Agricultural Administrator of Dantooine. After the Sith attack, she kept us together. Without her, the only thing you'd see around here are mercenaries. We had problems with Mandalorian mercenaries even before the Jedi Civil War. The Jedi helped clear most of the problem up. But after the war, many soldiers from both sides of the conflict became mercenaries. And since we're so far from the core, some started gathering here. The difference between an out-of-work mercenary and a raider is a vibroblade's edge. The only thing we can prove they've done is intimidate a few farmers. The farmers give them goods, money, or food just to stay on their good side. The only one that isn't scared of them is the administrator. There have also been a lot of disappearances recently, and not all of them can be blamed on cath hounds. But nobody can prove the mercenaries are responsible. A farmer here and there, or a family. We lost enough people during the war that keeping the Cath Hound and Kinrath populations under control hasn't been possible. So there are a lot of animal attacks. Some deaths, too. The disappearances might be just coincidence, but a lot of the stubborn folks seem to be more accident-prone. Just head into the building and you'll find your way to the Administrator. I'll be over by the entrance if you need anything else. A Jedi. I've got to tell the others. Ah, leave me be, Jedi. Error. Recording partially corrupted. Resolving. Today I caught her in a heated argument with my Padawan. Her master refuses to properly discipline. I want to know what action you intend. Luke, I respect your wisdom, but it is not your concern. But uncontrolled. Whatever the other Padawans see her do, they are quick to do the same. Other students dislike her intensely. True. An average student of the Force, but with a unique strength, is a natural leader. I strongly disagree. Mediocre Jedi. Lust for power. Will lead to the dark side. Furthermore, in... Recording degraded. End playback. I think Tarn has finally cracked. Running around like a madman, raving that he was being chased by a Jedi. Oh, Tarn is an idiot, to be sure. But he seemed genuinely frightened, and perhaps he did see something. Do you actually believe a Jedi would return here? After all they've done to us? They wouldn't dare. They certainly would. Well, you remember how they were. Always so superior, so arrogant, and never lending a hand when we really needed them. I still don't believe it. You should. My cousin's friend, he used to tend the gardens around the Enclave. He swears he saw a Jedi in Kunda. Could be hiding anywhere. Well, I hope it's true. I hear there's a bounty on them, and we could certainly use the money. Unless somebody beats you to it. Your luck is not of the hapless settler. You are the newcomer that lands in a battered ship, yes? No friendly greetings are here for you. I come here to speak to the militia and make them understand a truth. Something of mine they have in their possession. It's very unwise to stand in my way. I am done being inconvenienced by you. A visitor, please come in. Welcome to Kunda. I am Administrator Turina Adari. You're the owner of the, um, ship that just landed? Depending on your business here, the pleasure may be mutual. But you didn't answer my question. Is that ship yours? I meant no disrespect at all. It is, in fact, a remarkable vessel. And unless I'm much mistaken, that's the Ebon Hawk. That vessel has been on Dantooine before, during the war. That was a Jedi vessel. Of course not. I'm trying to stabilize an entire planet. An exchange bounty, no matter how abundant, is little use in that endeavor. But if a Jedi were here, that would best be kept secret. 
Right or wrong, our settlers blame the Jedi and their hidden enclave for their suffering. I remember the old Jedi Masters and the considerable help they lent to Dantooine. I still maintain discreet connections with Jedi. I suppose your arrival here is no coincidence. Indeed, true coincidence seems very rare in the affairs of Jedi. But I should tell you, my friend, let's just call him Frook. We've known each other for many years, and our continued friendship could create many problems in the current political climate. He came to Dantooine not too long ago. He was looking into something quite important. He's gone missing recently. Did he send for you in case something went wrong? We need the skills of a Jedi more than ever. He was helping investigate Asgul and his mercenaries, but he had his own errand to run in the Enclave. Jedi business of some sort. <laughs> I best nick a touch in my pal, Crowe Nosha. What a lot of Shiba Fusot, but she'll have no but Chubanok. Yatuka, Uwanrika, Chotin, Wanima, Rata Wakata, Chiluma Lithpa. Krempawi, Chosimaranta, Weber Gonorimbo. Harandoto, Jun Sorito Mas, Jurun Makagroto Soto. Yatuka u wanrika chotin wanima orata wakata chi luma lithpa. Kavanata kalu! Kavanami donki krato. Charika yayakta min sobachina ninga balo cha juxo ni chortuna. Kavanata kalu! Kavanami donki krato. Bram tabanin sochu. Da come just mak miki baranye doso so rika chondin? Wana magrable mogo. Yatuka u wan rika chotin wani maorata wakata chi luma lithpa. Kavadumpa mo wendido chokerembi norta kunyun wish chawaka chuba. Sura dachi morutuko kansa. Yatuka u wanrika chotin wani maorata wakata chi luma lithpa. Kavanata kalu! Kavanami donki krato. Chonta boso lectu masi no surenkeda! Banak luci unte me sakrawi no rutu. Your thoughts are disturbed. I can feel them from a great distance, like a sugar running through you. Echo. I feel echoes of the Force here. Force-sensitive locations such as this absorb and reflect Force energy. The crystals are the catalyst here. I sense that Revan once passed through here, leaving a strong impression behind in the crystals. Perhaps future Jedi who visit this cave will feel our presence, as if seeing our footprints preserved in the soil. The crystals here are infused with the Force. Some could be harvested and used for lightsabers. The crystals here do not drain force energy from Jedi. 
They collect the excess energy that radiates from those attuned to the Force. What is it? with you is such that the stronger you become in the force, the more powerful your crystal will grow. Statement. Master, I must express some degree of concern. As I have studied your actions, looking for potential vulnerabilities to exploit, I have found several. Statement. Master, it is nothing personal, but professional pride dictates that I keep a running tally on any potential weaknesses in my masters. And of course, the weaknesses of any other sentient meatbags, droids, or other targets who are in service to my master. Hypothetical. Master, it is entirely possible that one day you may no longer be my master and that my new master might get jealous of our prior relationship. It has happened before. As a result, I have a responsibility to know your weaknesses should I be required to assassinate you. Do you feel it? The wound on this world, it is centered here. If we succeed in gathering the Jedi, they will come to this place. And if those Jedi are slain, then all that remains of the Order shall be drawn here as well. We will know when the time comes, and I hope our enemies do not. I... I wanted to say thanks for what you showed me on Nar Shaddaa. It's gonna take some time to let it sink in, but... but thanks. I feel alive. Announcement. You have caused us to expenditure a great deal of effort to find you, Jedi. Annoying recitation. Let us proceed to facilitate communications. <laughs> Failing, Master. Who are we missing? We're one off. We're missing Joran. I don't see Joran. That runt of a cat hound, he's the one with the backpack. Did anybody grab anything from the room? Anybody? What do you want? You won't find anything there except on the lowest sub-level, and there you'll only find death. Lagrex are everywhere. Nothing. Find out for yourself. I'm not interested in training the competition. Now, if you don't mind, we're going someplace you can't eavesdrop on us, and get down to our business. 